American journalist Dave Lees praised the performance of Olympic champion Alina Zajitova at the Russian Challenge Show program tournament. Zajitova in a white wig and white dress appeared in the form of actress and singer Marilyn Monroe. The judges rated Zajitova's performance with the ninth sum of points of the day. I will be hated for this. I feel very sad every time Alina Zajitova comes out. It always seems to be some kind of public spanking or ridicule. Everything she does is like this a really beautiful girl, but not smart. The Calder suit, a cheap wig from the basement. It was a bad wig. But they really added a level of Russian cringe, because in Russia one of the ways to get a lot of attention to these athletes is to post photos on social networks. They just, of course, had to add a level of spunk to Marilyn Monroe. At the very end of this program, the skirt is lifted with the help of a wind machine. It was so tasteless and cringe, but expected. Lise is quoted as saying in the Skating Lesson podcast. Alina Zajitova my Marilyn Monroe. Finally, I was able to share this image with you at the Russian Challenge Show Tournament. It looks so unusual and completely unusual for me, but that makes me like it even more. It turns out that this program really became for me to some extent a challenge to itself. Many thanks to my fans for their support. Your bright banners and posters, as always, in the heart. Did you immediately recognize me in this image? Zajitova wrote in her Telegram channel. Now I can definitely say that the coaches and I did everything right, choosing a completely new image of Marilyn Monroe for me, in which we tried to achieve an exact match and external resemblance to the actress. For skaters who are more accustomed to skating competitive programs, with an emphasis on technical content and an emotional component, this was not an easy task. During these days, I watched a lot of films with Monroe, singled out her characteristic things, and then, standing in front of the mirror, repeated, practice these movements, gestures, head tilts, even facial expressions, details. For me it was a completely new experience even performing in a wig, when first you had to style your hair in a special way, a similar costume worn by Monroe, a microphone with which it was necessary to accurately reproduce the movements of the heroine. Or the final moment of the performance the famous shots when Marilyn's skirt rises. This detail also had to be worked out so as not to overdo it, but these subtleties already depended on the performance technicians. With all the seeming ease of my number, the coaches and I did a huge amount of work on the rink and off the ice. And if you evaluate this work and the performance itself, for me it really was a step forward and about the fact that the presented number does not suit me. Well, hello to all well-wishers, especially critics and some journalists whom I do not leave without work. They discuss my performances and my life with such zeal and detail that it's scary to think what these people would do without me.